is the Big O Show. This is the Big O Show. Even Bill didn't realize it right there. Like, oh, that's right. If we win next week, we matched our entire season total in the first eight weeks of the season. We got a whole half a year left, and we're five and three. Talk it's, about being ahead of pace, bro. I mean, are you kidding me? It's ridiculous. Anybody that looks at our team and doesn't realize what's going on, they, they just don't get And this isn't an aberration. This isn't a fluke. The fluke is when you do Tony Sperano 11 and 5 and then you can't ever come close to it again. The fluke is Adam Gase 10 and 6 and you never come close to it again. That's the fluke. When you go from 5 and 11 to now you're 4 and 3 in your first 7 games and you're easily going to surpass your your total from last year, that's called improvement. That means you're trending in the right direction. When you've won nine of your last 16 after losing your first seven, that's trending in the right direction. The last three weeks. When you had a You go out to San Fran, you smoke San Fran. Yes. You blank like you should the Jets. Jets. I mean, the Jets got nine points against Kansas City yesterday. That's right. Okay? It's a, in it's Kansas a, City. It's a divisional game. You yes. throw a lot of crap out, it, dude, out the window when it's you a never, game. You never bring records or anything like that to a divisional game. That's why I hate right. betting divisional games. Yes. And yesterday to beat the Rams, five and two coming into your place. Yeah. It's a, it's, it, <laughs> it, we're a different team, man. We're a different franchise. Like, you know, whether it's Screaming A or all these idiots that are out there, when you tell them, hey, do you know the Dolphins are nine and seven in our last 16? They're going to go, huh? Because all they remember is 0 and seven. Look where your defense is now. Do you remember the games from last year? Do you want me to read the scores from last year? In the first couple weeks? Do you remember those scores? Remember that defense? What was it, 100 and something to nothing the first two weeks? Yeah, it was, like, ridiculous. Okay? So remember that defense and look at the defense now. I'm, I'm just sorry. I, 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 we watched this. You and I watched this. You know what I mean? That's why I can't listen to these people. Because they're really not watching what we're doing. They're really not watching what our team is actually accomplishing and how quickly they're accomplishing it. You'll see. Others will try to do the same thing. Ricardo says, Big O, you're an effing stud. Great knowledge and brutal honesty. That's what we try to keep it, bro. Herman says, Big O. Uh, Big O, remember how far Van Ginkle ran to tackle the wide receiver? Although the play was brought back because of a penalty, but he ran a long way and never stopped. That's my boy, bro. I love Van Ginkle. Been a Van Ginkle guy from day one. It took Miami 15 weeks to get four wins last year. They've already matched it. Exactly. I remember last last season you were pissed when Van Ginkle started to go and then he got pulled. Yeah. He wasn't in the lineup. It was like, where is this kid? What is it? What's going on? Yeah, I like him, man. Uh, I was not impressed with Tua. Is Greer now taking a closer look at Trevor Lawrence? There we go. After all that, we get a Bromar smelly comment. Um, let's see. What else do we have? Aside from the KC game, the remaining games are all winnable. I agree. I agree. The KC one's going to be a bitch. But, I mean, you know, it is what it is. That's fine. I... I I didn't even think we would be in this position in year two. So, you know, I'm kind of just waiting for year four when we win the Super Bowl. You know, that's all. Uh, let's see. Uh, big O, good afternoon. It's a shame that even after a win, the media still has to find something negative, like how ineffective the offense was and how Changeli has not done a good job. It pisses me off. changeli has been outstanding. Yesterday was tough on everybody. And by the way, Alex, it's not just the media. You can see Bromar smelly there and a couple of others they're also with the ridiculous thing about you know Tua. 